This particular video has actually been in my mind to film, but the problem is I don't know how to convey my message or I don't know how to convey my thoughts to you guys just because I don't know how to put it into words, but we are going to try. Now, this particular video is all about a light skin, the obsession with light skin, and just so you know that when it comes to this whole light skin of a thing, there is actually a huge disadvantage. To be honest and to be sincere, I understand the obsession of light skin, but sometimes I choose not to understand. I mean, like, I understand that the what beauty standard of beauty is light skin which is very crazy which makes people now go to bleach their skin try to be light skin and just be a different person from themselves because you're trying to bleach out your skin or become light skin when you're not light skin in general is you trying to become another person and i mean i understand that self-esteem comes sometimes comes from you loving yourself and then you think that bleaching your skin is going to make you love yourself more it's crazy because it's not the solution it's not even the case do you get what i mean or the fact that you think that you're all that skin color meaning your dark skin color your chocolate skin color or your caramel skin color is not beautiful i mean like how do i explain it to you guys that when it comes to this particular light skin color that you guys tend to admire that is because there is so much work to put when it comes to maintaining of light skin color that is the number one disadvantage of light skin there is just a lot of work to be done when it comes to maintaining of your light skin color the moment you're under the sun you're immediately tan the moment something happens you're just tan melanin production begins to happen in your skin and if you're not cautious if you're not careful your light skin color or your fair skin color is just going to be looking very tacky very uneven and just very not beautiful that is why when it comes to light skin there is just so much work to maintain a particular light skin color light skin color is literally high maintenance in my own opinion and that is one disadvantage i don't like about it is like high maintenance for no just cause now imagine the fact that you now bleached your skin i mean like that's just crazy because you're going to be spending more and more and more and more just to maintain that particular skin color and then you're ruining your skin because when it comes to bleach skin it's not healthy and every other product you're going to be using on your skin is not going to be healthy because if you eventually start using healthy products on your skin it's going to reverse the color so you keep on and continue using unhealthy products on your skin that's going to damage your skin barrier ruin your skin give you skin cancer and make you look older than your age speaking of older than your age do you know that light skin color also tend to this may sound off or this may sound weird but when it comes to light skin color light skin color tend to shrink and age more faster than dark skin melanin color do you know that i mean i wish you know that i actually i'm actually making this video because i saw a post i'm going to be leaving some comments that people were making and it was just heartbreaking to be very honest and some they are very true some they are very false and it's true because when it comes to this same light skin of it in light skin is just as i said in the beginning is just what people tame to be the beauty standard so because you're light skin that is where you're going to be noticed that is where you're going to be recognized that's not the case to be honest and to be fair i feel like if a dark skin person that takes care of their skin very well like your skin is literally glazing to the gods like you take care of your melanin and the first skin person enter the room together with that dark skin person that's taking care of their skin color i feel like they're going to notice the dark skin person more or is it just me i mean like the moment they see that your dark is very beautiful that you're maintaining your skin color the way you ought to they are going to want to know exactly how the hell is this even real like am i seeing a goddess am i seeing the moon do you get what i mean that you don't like your skin tone or your skin color is just because you're not taking care of it very well this whole light skin light skin obsession you need to stop that's why there's so much people bleaching their skin at this point in time i saw a post on tiktok i mean maybe you have seen it maybe you have not but there is this girl that bleached her skin it's crazy she bleached her skin she realized that she doesn't want to bleach her skin anymore she wants to become her original skin tone which is caramel slash chocolate skin tone but the off and weird thing in this whole thing is that people were asking for the product she used in bleaching her skin and guess what let me bust your head she's actually selling it to them and when i tell you that she's doing sold out every other day is like it's crazy so that you're trying to lighten your skin is because you feel like that is the world beauty standard i'm sorry but there's many disadvantage or should i say yeah some disadvantage to it not many now when it comes to light skin the barest minimum of something that happens to you it immediately damage your skin like i now remember when i'm growing up how well my mom was very cautious of our skin tone because all of us in our house we are kind of very fair literally so i remember growing up as a kid she never really allowed us to play some kind of rough play that other children will be playing and just you know this kind of play you enjoy yourself and 
like it's just crazy and when she ever she's talking she's always tell us that you will enjoy yourself now it's not now you're going to understand what is going to happen but it's in the future because when it comes to light skin the small injury you will have will leave a permanent dark spot there and your skin will become very uneven small mosquito bites that will happen to you your your skin is red like literally me something will just bite small thing will just bite me my skin is red when it comes to light skin we tend to suffer skin redness a lot like the small sun that will hammer skin redness before it now become melanin i had an irritation on my skin and it left these very red marks like red red dots and i remember a friend seen it i was like yeah this is why you don't fancy light skin because any small thing is very obvious and it's very beautiful i just hope this video is making sense i'm just trying to tell you now that the main cook of this video is to explain to you that when it comes to this light skin obsession there is more to it it's beautiful on camera it's beautiful in real life but like the behind the scenes of maintaining the light skin is crazy like is crazy i have this period acne that like i wish you guys can see it is it popping through my makeup like literally i'm just waiting for it to completely dry out and then leave the wonderful dark spot it normally leaves that will eventually take four months or three months to clear out literally why because of i'm light skin yet you want to be obsessed with light skin yet you don't want to maintain your skin tone the secret of a good skin is not the color that should be one thing you should take out of this video the secret of a beautiful skin is not actually the color the secret is how well you understand that color and how you maintain it there are some light skin you actually see you're not going to fancy it but unfortunately you don't tend to see those kind because when it comes to light skin they are too cautious of their skin but there are some light skin you genuinely see you will not fancy it because they are not taking care of their skin and that's the same way you don't like your skin because you're not taking care of your skin if you take care of your skin believe and trust me you're going to love your skin you're going to be in love with your skin you're going to question why in god's name are you looking at other people's skin there are many people now that have regretted bleaching their skin there are many people now that have, that have regretted trying to lighten out their skin and just have this light skin tone or fair skin tone that you guys want and when they eventually realize that that's not even the deal like literally when you eventually become light skin what next um have you thought of that like what next is it really going to boost your self-esteem no it's just you that can literally boost your self-esteem. It's not your skin color. So when it comes to light skin, I need you guys to pipe down, okay? But that doesn't mean that if you're naturally light skin is a crime, like me. I've accepted that I'm light skin and duh. And it's crazy because when people see your light skin, they tend to think that it's just the light skin that you have. That, in fact, if you have not gotten this comment as a light skin person, then... Mm, thumbs up to you because when it comes to this whole light skin the first thing somebody that doesn't like you will say is you're beautiful because you're light skin mm. okay thank you that's your opinion not my i can't change it so i'm not even going to bother but that's just it light skin obsession with light skin obsession with trying to bleach out your skin should talk we can do better. This is 2024. I don't need you guys to come to my DM to be asking me how to bleach your skin. And for Christ's sake, can I also put this out of the way that it's not everybody that is actually light skin that bleached their skin. Where are we also getting that part from? Like immediately you see that somebody's light skin, you immediately think that they bleached their skin. In fact, in my house, we are very fair. My cousin is extremely fair. If care is not even taken, I'm sure I would have even given birth to Abino because we are that fair. My, have you seen my grandma? God bless her soul. But yeah, so it's not every light skin you see out there that is bleached that i need to put that in this video too because you're coming to my dm to be asking how what am i going to use now to lighten out my skin two to three shade lighter i put it out to you that lighting of the skin is not the same thing as bleaching out the skin does doesn't mean you should not be mad and come to my dm to come and be asking of bleaching of the skin or how you will light it because you put it healthy lighting <laughs> or because you damn it lighting of your skin when you know that you're never light skin or when you know that you are never fair skin doesn't make it right or doesn't make it not bleaching it's still bleaching because you're using the term lighting doesn't mean it's not bleaching so i appreciate your skin tone i appreciate your skin color and just maintain it that's the secret maintain your skin tone and trust and believe me you're going to love your skin tone if i was not maintaining my skin tone you're not going to like it that's just the honest truth like when i look at my product sometimes i'm like this is unnecessary but if i don't have a hyperpigmentation treatment in my product in my routine i can't even survive but you dark skin all i just feel like people need to do is maintain it glow your skin just look for product that's going to just brighten out your skin and just even out your skin tone and your skin is going to be it's going to be eating slow down with this whole you want to be light skin i'm just making this video so that number one you're not going to come to my dm again and look for skincare consultation and i ask you what is your skin go you say you want to lighten your skin i ask you okay what happened that you're now dark you don't tell me no you just want to lighten your skin. i will block you 
with my full chest i will block you okay so i just need you guys to understand that light skin i feel like the only advantage itself when it comes to this whole light skin thing is the fact that people think that's um that's the word beauty standard and then its advantage is they think that is light skin because you're light skin that's why you get everything that you worked for very crazy <laughs> talk of pretty girl privilege i think that's something called light skin privilege at this point like bro what's what are we in so you need to understand that when it comes to beauty standard it changes so how long do you want to keep changing yourself and changing yourself and changing yourself because of the word beauty standard keep changing you don't know there was a time i remember when skinny was the deal like when i say skinny i mean lepa skinny now is bbl <clears throat> soon it's going to be skinny again then the people that rush to do bbl will be thinking of how to remove it ah, ah now are you not seeing how it's going round and round and round in circle so we really need to stop this whole obsession with trying to be something that we are not god bless you with a chocolate skin maintain it god bless you with a light skin not bad still maintain it god bless you with a dark melanin skin tone maintain it take care of it that is skincare skincare is taking care of the skin that you find yourself in not trying to change your skin color change your skin color is bleaching okay so i don't know but i hope this video made sense in my head i don't know what i did but i just hope it made sense or you got something sharp from this particular video but yeah i'll see you guys next time and this is just also a warning for anybody that comes to my dm to say they want to bleach their skin you will never hear from me because i will block you you're never going to see my account okay you can come to me that you have a particular skin concern skin issues acne hyperpigmentation skin roughness skin dryness is fine but the moment you come and say somebody said they want to healthy the word is i want to bleach my skin in a healthy way oh benny because you added healthy doesn't make it make sense all right so don't do that next time anyways i trust to see you guys in my next video i'll see you guys actually well yeah i'm exhausted already like today has been a long day so bye guys <laughs>